Well, hello and how are you? Hey friends, welcome to the Shen Show. I am your host, Senator Briscoe, coming to you from right here in St. Charles, Missouri. Hey, you know what? Today is uh, Monday, February 10th, 2020. And you know what that means? That means that it just so happens to be Stacy Joe's birthday. So, uh, without further ado, here's a birthday song for you. I said, hey, I heard it's your birthday today. So happy birthday, I must say. You know, Stacy, you made it another year today. So happy birthday to you today. I said, hey, I heard it's your birthday today. So happy birthday, I must say. Hey, I know you're one more year older today. So happy birthday to you, I say. And many more. You cha 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 Hey, and I also got a happy Facebook friend anniversary going out to Caitlin Marie Hodges. So happy friend anniversary to you. Facebook friend anniversary, that is. Caitlin, happy friend anniversary. Happy, happy friend anniversary. Don't you know you're a friend to me? Oh, how I. Go along, and the things that we'll see. Happy, happy, friend anniversary. Oh, sorry, made that one up as flying by the seat of the pants. Don't you know? Hey, anyway, let's uh, do some local weather for the St. Charles viewing area. St. Charles City, that is. Missouri. Tuesday, February 10th. Cloudy skies, highs around 39 degrees Fahrenheit, winds north at 5 to 10 miles per hour, 32 degrees out there right now. And cloudy overnight, lows around 31 degrees Fahrenheit, winds are going to be light and variable, um, north at, oh, probably 1 to 5 miles per hour, somewhere in there. And then... Tuesday, February 11th, some sun in the morning with increasing clouds during the afternoon. Highs around 43 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds are going to be north to west at 5 to 10 miles per hour. And then giving way to cloudy overnight with lows around 32 degrees Fahrenheit and winds light and variable. Probably eastward uh, around, let's say, 6 miles per hour. Sure, we'll go with that. And then Wednesday, February 12th, rain and snow in the morning, turning into rain in the afternoon. Highs around 38 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds east at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Chances of precipitation, 90%. That's right, 90% chances of snow rain, or rain snow, or whichever comes first in that order. Alrighty, and then Wednesday night, uh, this is February 12th still, uh, alright, <laughs> rain, 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 rain and snow in the evening, and a few snow showers later on, while otherwise mostly cloudy, lows around 21 degrees Fahrenheit, winds are going to be northwest at about 10 to 20 miles per hour, chances of snow about 70%, snow accumulations, well, less than one inch, and then how about Thursday, February 13th? Cloudy skies early with partly cloudy in the afternoon. Much colder, highs around 26 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds are going to be northwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. And then some clouds early will give way to generally clear conditions overnight. Lows around 8 degrees Fahrenheit and winds north to northwest at 10 to 15 miles per hour. And then Friday, for our final fifth day of the five-day forecast, mainly sunny skies, highs around 29 degrees Fahrenheit, winds coming directly out of the east at 5 to 10 miles per hour, and then mainly clear skies overnight, lows around 22 degrees Fahrenheit, and winds are going to be coming out of the southeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. And so there you have it. That's your five-day forecast for the St. Charles viewing area you know what i did get a uh, uh um song request for uh, uh from a friend of mine a friend of mine he put out a song request and you know 
I would not have expected it because, well, he never, ever, ever, uh, he tells me not to sing most of the time. So, I'm going to do it for him. Let's see. We'll go with uh, song requests. Wake up. Song requests. Mm, let's see. Oh, he said Sad Eyes by Robert John, but I can't do Sad Eyes. Scratch that. Go to sleep. Um, that was what he had said was Sad Eyes, but I, I can't do Sad Eyes. I might be able to pull up some Bob Seger and pull off some Bob Seger. Song lyrics, Bob Seger. A to Z lyrics. Let's see what all sounds Bob Seeger has. We had talked about a bunch of different songs yesterday, and we had I sang a few of them, and he says, "Yeah, those will work," but then, but then. Along came Jones, smooth talking Jones, long lean Jones. Oh, let's see. Um, let's try this one. Yeah, I'm going to tell you a tale. Come on, come on. I'll give a listen. Come on, come on, and give a listen. Cause I was born lonely down by the riverside. Learned to spin fortune wheels. Learned to spin fortune wheels and throw dice. And I was just 13 when I had to leave home. Knew I couldn't stick around, I had to roam. Ain't good looking, but you know I ain't shy. Ain't afraid to look a girl or a hate in the eye. So if I need some loving uh, and you need it right away, take a little time out and maybe I'll stay. But I got a gambler, I'm a rambling man. Ooh, I got to be a gambling man. Gotta go a rambling man. Oh, I was born a rambling man. That ain't the way this song goes at all. I am gonna beat my head upon the wall. Don't mess around with any old rambling man. Did up one did ba da ba ba do do ba ba do 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 da da. Had up ba did do ba da ba ba da 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 ba beat ba ba do ba. I don't think. I know any of these here songs. Truck driving songs is one that he said I should do. Maybe a song like Convoy for You. I'll try that one. Song lyrics, Convoy. Well, there was a dark of the moon on the 6th of June in a Kenworth pulling logs. Cab over Pete with a reefer on and a Jimmy hauling the hogs. Was, we was headed for the Bear on I-108, well, 101, but a mile out of Shaggy Town. I says, pig pen, this here's the rubber duck, and I'm about to put that hammer down. Cause we've got a little convoy a rockin' through the night. Yeah, we've got a little convoy. Ain't she a beautiful sight? Come on and join our convoy. Ain't nothing gonna get in our way. We got a little convoy. And we're truckin' convoy across this USA convoy. Well, by the time we hit Tulsa town, we had 85 trucks in all. But there's a roadblock up ahead on the clover leaf, and then bears is wall to wall. 
Mm, yeah, them Smokies as thick as bugs on a bumper. They even had a bear in the air. And I says, calling all trucks, this here's the duck. Oh, we better go bear hunting. Cause we got a little convoy a rocking through the night. Yeah, we've got a little convoy. Ain't she a beautiful sight? Come on and join in our convoy. Ain't nothing gonna keep, get us on, get us in our way. We got rolled this trucking convoy across the USA. Convoy. Well, we rolled up in the state 44 like a rocket sled on rails. We tore up out of the, our swindle sheets and left them sitting on the scales. By the time we hit that shy town, them bears was a getting smart. They'd brought up some reinforcements from the Illinois National Guard and them armored cars and tanks and jeeps and rigs is of every size. Yeah, them chicken coops was full of bars and choppers full of in the skies. Mm, yeah, them chicken coop. Well, we shot the line and went for broke with a thousand screaming trucks and eleven long-haired friends of Jesus and in a shot-toos microbus. Oh, we laid a strip for the Jersey Shore and prepared to cross the line. I was, I could have seen the bridge was lined with bars, but I didn't have a doggone dime. I says, pig pen, this here's the rubber duck. Uh, we just ain't gonna pay no toll. So we crashed that gate doing 98, and I says, let them truckers roll. Ten war, cause we got a little convoy rocking through the night. Yeah, we got a little convoy, ain't she a beautiful sight? Come on, join our convoy, ain't nothing gonna get in our way. Oh, we gotta roll this trucking convoy, across the USA convoy. Alright, alright. How about some more trucking songs? Um, song lyrics, White Line. I think this is the one. Oh, nope, that's not the one. Well, the white line's the lifeline of the nation. And so on. Song lyrics, white line is the lifeline of the nation. Moving on, that's what it is. Is that right? Big wheels rolling, big wheels rolling, moving on. A big wheels rolling, gotta keep them going. Big wheels rolling, moving on. Well, the white line's the lifeline of the nation. And the men like Will and the Sunny make it move. And on, loving it, and gypsies all the ways on the go. Don't. Don't what they best know how to do. Jamming gears and got the beer to bring on the favors. Wait a minute. What's it called? Big wheels rolling on. Right, I'm going to do it that way. Song lyrics, big wheels rolling on. Then I'm going to get a drink. A big wheels rolling, big wheels rolling, moving on. A big wheels rolling, got to keep them rolling. Big wheels rolling, moving on. Uh, the white wine's the lifeline of the nation. And men like Will and Sonny make it move. Living like a gypsy, always on the go. Don't. What the best know how doing what the best they know how to do. Jim and jamming gears has got to be a fever. Cause men become addicted to the grind. It takes a special breed to be a truck driving man and a steady hand to pull that load behind. Big wheels rolling, big wheels rolling, moving on. Gotta keep moving, a big wheel's rolling, moving on. 
Yeah, the white line's the lifeline of the nation. And men like Will and Sonny make it move. Living like a gypsy, always on the go. Doing what they best know how to do. Well, jamming gears has got to be a fever. Cause men become addicted to the grind. Takes a special man. It takes a special breed to be a truck driving man. And a steady hand to pull that load behind. Big wheels are rolling. Big wheels rolling. Moving on. Gotta keep them rolling. Big wheels rolling. Moving on. Alright, alright, alright. Truck driving man. Well, there's gotta be another truck driving man. Truck driving songs doing best that I can. Dooby dooby stoobus. Mm, gotta do the do list. Gotta do my do list. To do my do list. Truck driving man's on the hand. Let's see, there's some other truck songs. Truck driving songs. Oh, you know, one of my favorite truck driving songs that I single quite a bit. I gotta, I gotta watch out for that one though. Sing it too much. There's two of them that I sing quite a bit. There's another one that, um. Uh, Um, song lyrics trucking on down the other side. I think it's Wolf Creek Pass. Pretty sure. <laughs> Wolf Creek Pass. Let's see. Men are over hauling chickens on a flatbed out of Wiggins. And we'd spent all night on the upside of a 37-mile hill called Wolf Creek Pass, which is up on the Great Divide. Yeah, see, that's the right song, but I don't remember how it goes. We were sitting there sucking two picks and drinking knee-high in an onion soup mix. And I said, Earl, let's... I'll make them. Yeah, this is the one. Wolf Creek Pass. Song lyrics, Wolf Creek Pass. Well, there's got to be a better way to have it written out. They didn't do it like normal. And it's hard to read that way. Maybe it'll be read, read different this way. No, it's still the same. Me and Earl were hauling chickens on a flatbed out of Wiggles and Wiggins, and we'd spent all night on an uphill side of a 37 mile miles of a hill called Wolf Creek Pass, which is up on the Great Divide. We was sitting there sucking toothpicks and drinking knee-high and onion scoop mix, and I said, Earl, let's mail a card to Mother and then send them chickens on down the other side. Yeah, let's just give them a ride. Wolf Creek Pass way up on the Great Divide, trucking on down the other side. Well, Earl put down his bottle and mashed his foot down on the throttle. And then a couple of boobs with a thousand cubes and a 90-foot, eight Peterbilt, 90, 1948 Peterbilt screamed alive. We woke up them chickens. Well, we roared up uh, off of the shoulder spraying them pine cones, rocks, and a boulders and put 400 head of them Rhode Island Reds and a couple of burnt out roosters on the line. 
Look out below, cause here we go. Wolf Creek Pass, way up on the Great Divide. Trucking on down the other side. Well, we commenced to truckin' and them hens commenced to cluckin' and Earl took to out and match and struck his and scratched his pants and lit up the unused half of a dollar cigar and took a puff. Says, my, ain't that purty up here. I says, Earl, this hill can spill us. You better slow down or you're going to kill us. Just make one mistake and it's the pearly gates for them. Eighty-five crates of U.S. approved cluckers. You want to hit second? Wolf Creek Pass, way up on the Great Divide. Trucking on down the other side. Well, Earl, he grabbed on that shifter and he stabbed her into fifth gear and then the chrome-plated, pearly illuminated genuine accessory shift knob come right off in his hand. I says, you want to screw that thing back on? <laughs> Earl, <laughs> he was trying to thread it on when the fire fell off his cigar and dropped down, sort of rolled around and then lit the cuff of his Earl's pants and burned a hole in his sock. Yow! Sort of set him right on fire. I looked out the window and I started counting pole, phone poles when by the rate of four and then seventy po power and well I put two and two together and added twelve and curried five and come up with twenty two thousand telephone poles in an hour. <laughs> well I looked at Earl and his eyes was wide and his lips was curled and his leg was fried and his hand was frozen to the wheel like a tongue uh, to a slab in the middle of a blizzard. And I says, Earl, I'm not uh, the type to complain, but yeah, the type has, time has come for me to explain that if you don't apply some brakes real soon, they're going to have to pick us up with a stick and a spoon. Well, Earl, he reared back and, he, the, and choked his leg and cocked his leg and stepped down as hard as he could on the brakes and the pedal went clear to the floor and stayed right there on the floor. He said it was sort of like stepping on a plum. Well, from there, there on down, it just went really purty. It was a hairpin country and a switchback city. One of them looked like a can full of Worms and the other one looked like a marillard uh, germ. Right into the middle of the whole damn show, we was a real nice tunnel. <laughs> now, wouldn't you know? Wolf Creek Pass way up on the Great Divide. Went trucking on down the other side. Signs was saying chances of 12 to 12 foot line, but the chickens was stacked in 3 and 9, 13 and 9. Well, we shot that tunnel at 110 and like gas through the funnel and eggs through in a, throwing a hen. And we took the top row, row of chickens off of that slacker, then the scum off of Louisiana. Slicker than scum off a of Louisiana swamp. Went down and around and around and down till we hit and ran all out of ground. At the edge of the town, bashed into the side of a feed store in a downtown Pagosa Springs. Wolf Creek Pass way up on the Great Divide, trucking on down the other side. I said, Wolf Creek Pass way up on the Great Divide, trucking on down the other side. You gotta realize it's been years and years and years and years, and a lot more years than that since I've heard that song. So, that's why it sounded like it sounded. Let's see, uh, what have we done here? Ooh, 24 minutes. Got time for one more. And it'll be a talker. You know, I like my story songs. And, of course, 
my story truck driving song. I've got two of them, and I'm not going to do Teddy Bear because my eye is weepy enough already, and I just don't want to start a new thing. Um, You know what? There is another song that goes something like turning that truck around on a dime. Give me 40 acres, I think. Song li- Song lyrics, give me 40 acres. Well, he was headed into Boston in a big, long diesel truck. It was his first trip to Boston. He was having lots of luck. He was going the wrong direction, down a one-way street in town. And this is what he said when the police chased him down. Give me 40 acres and I'll turn this rig around. That's the easiest way that I have found. Some guys can turn it on a dime and turn it right downtown. But I need 40 acres to turn this rig around. When he finally found where he to unload, he had a dreadful shock. His trailer pointed toward the road and his cab right to the dock. And as he looked around him through the tears, he made this sound. Oh, give me 40 acres and I'll turn this rig around. Give me 40 acres and I'll turn this rig around. It's the easiest way that I have found. Some guys can turn it on a dime or turn it around downtown. But I need 40 acres to turn this rig around. When he finally got unloaded, he was glad to leave the town. He was very happy heading back to Alabama. When he, uh, way up ahead, he saw a sign that said, Now you're northbound. He said, Give me 40 acres, and I'll turn this rig around. Give me 40 acres and I'll turn this rig around. It's the easiest way I've found. Some guys can turn it on a dime and turn it right downtown. But give me 40 acres and I'll turn this rig around. Well, he was driving down the right lane when ahead he saw a sign. Now he's got to make a left turn, but he cannot get in line. And the tears were streaming down his cheeks, and they all heard him yell, Give me 40 sticks of dynamite, and I'll blow this thing to, well, give me 40 acres, and I'll turn this rig around. It's the easiest way that I have found. Some guys can turn it on a dime, or turn it right downtown. But give me 40 acres, and I'll turn this rig around. All right, there we go. That was that. All right, looks like it's about time for our portion of the program called Our Daily Bread. And so, therefore, today's devotion is called In It Together. Now, of course, like I've always said, you can always go to uh, odb.org to be able to read the daily devotion. Like that, like I said, they won't allow me to read it, and so, therefore, you'll have to read it on your own. I can only read the scripture that goes with it, and today that scripture is Romans 12, 9 through 16. And so here we go. Romans 12, 9 through 16. Love must be sincere. Hate what is evil. Cling to what is good. Be be devoted to one another in love. Honor one another above yourselves. Never be lacking in zeal, but keep your spiritual favors serving the Lord. Be joyful in hope, patient in affection, faithful in prayer. Share with the Lord people... Share the Lord's people who are in need and practice hospitality. Bless those who persecute you. Bless and do not curse. Rejoice with those who rejoice. Mourn with those who mourn. 
live in harmony with one another, and do not be proud, but be willing to associate with people of low position, and do not be conceited. And there you have it, Romans 12, 9 through 16, which does kind of pertain to uh, in it together, because we are all in it together. Now, if you follow the Bible with Briscoe, today we are going to be covering Leviticus 8 through 10 and Matthew 25, 31 through 46. And I just hope that I get through that one a lot better than I did yesterday because, well, it was a tough one yesterday. Anyway, thank you for tuning in to the Shen Show today. You know, I got one more song for you, and that would be, well... Goodbye, my friends. It's a time to go. But over to them. Goodbye, my friends. It's time to go. I hate to leave you, but I really must go. So goodbye, my friends. Goodbye. This here has been Shenandoah Briscoe saying hello and how are you? Thanks for tuning in to the Shen Show. And as always, you know, God loves you and so do I. So be blessed in Jesus' name and come back and see me tomorrow because, well, I'll be here and I hope that you are too.